Well, guess who I get the honor of being joined by now? She is with us, the one, the only Becky Hammond. Becky, first of all, congratulations. What's your reaction to this nomination? Thank you. Um, obviously, it's always a huge honor um, being in a list of, of elite people. You know, Malika, they have this thing called first balloters, <laughs> and I'm a multi balloter, okay? So I feel <laughs> like if we were to keep score, I should win because I have the most ball ballots. Um, but it, it's always exciting this time of year. Um, you know, what an elite group. I mean, the, mm. the list of international players that you just went down, I mean, unbelievable. Um, I had the opportunity to work with Pau and obviously TP um, under Greg Popovich for so long. So uh, super amazing list. Yeah. Well, you're, you're first on all of our ballots, but you mentioned it. Greg Popovich, Tony <laughs> Parker. Let's start with Pop. Your reaction to him potentially getting in this year. I mean, I think, you know, you, you look at Coach Pop and what he's done uh, here in San Antonio. He really opened the doors to, to the international players. Um, I think opened a lot of eyes. He, he's always been an outside the box thinker. Um, so uh, I, I'm not, I mean, I'm not surprised. He's the greatest coach to ever coach the game. Um, and plus he must have reached a certain age requirement or something <laughs> that they're like, we got to get this guy in. Come on. There you go. <laughs> and now to Tony Parker, who I should mention, I didn't mention earlier, finished his career in Charlotte. The two of you were very close. You've shared stories with yeah. us about that. What makes him a Hall of Famer in your eyes? Oh, man, uh, his creativity, obviously winning, right? Um, winning comes to mind, obviously, down here in San Antonio. But his creativity, his ability um, to get in the paint, you know, he dominated the paint. And I think without guys like, like TP, you don't see the job around. It's all the evolution of the game. But he was one of the guys that was getting in there and doing work early. Um, his speed, he was super fast with the ball. Um, obviously got to play with some, some great players as well. Um, but I'm super excited for him. And, and again, you know, Dirk, Powell, Tony in, in that European group, um, mm. I really think opened a, a huge door for, for European players and, and the rest of the world, really. Becky. Now we have our two, the best players in the world. Yeah, see? All from Europe. There you go, <laughs> Becky. Thank you so much for spending a little bit of time with us here on NBA Today. We look forward to having you back in studio. Fingers crossed. Best of luck to you. Uh, thanks, guys. All right, we have a couple more nominees that we want to show you right now. Here's a look at some of them. The Basketball Hall of Fame Class of 2023 from the North American category. ESPN's own Mark Jackson's. Congratulations, my friend, as well as Sean Marion on the list. And then there's some other great coaches. You can see them on your screen. Congratulations to all of the nominees. Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.